It's a brand new day, so come on and play in a world that's waiting for you. We're about to begin, so come on in. There's so much to do at school, and you can do anything if you try. With friends like Timothy by your side, there's a new adventure in everything we do. We'll all be together, and you can come too. When Timothy goes to school. Do you like it pink, Juanita? Oh yes, and guess what else? What else? It echoes in here. Hello. <laughs> Well, hello, Maria. Juanita, come and get me. I fell out of my box. <laughs> Pappy, you're funny. Come on, Maria. I'll show you our new house. These are for you, Mama. They were growing in our yard. Thank you. If only I knew where we packed the vase. Look, Mama. That's the bus that will take you to Hilltop School tomorrow. Oh, but I won't know anyone at my new school. Well, not at first, but soon you will make new friends. Would you like it if I took you to school tomorrow? Yes. Please come with me. Hola, and good morning. Welcome to Hilltop School. I'm Mrs. Jenkins, and you must be Juanita. Hola. I'm Juanita's mother. I am pleased to meet you. I am pleased to meet you. Would you like to stay a while? Yes, thank you, Mrs. Jenkins. Boys and girls, I would like you to meet our new student, Juanita, and her mother, who will be joining us as well. Hello, Juanita. Juanita. Let's sing our welcome song to welcome Juanita. Nora, would you find Juanita and her mother two front row seats? Okay. This way, please. <laughs> Are we ready? everyone. Now that we've all welcomed Juanita, let's choose an activity for free time. You can play dress up, read a book, make something with blocks or beads, or do puzzles. Quick sticks! What would you like to do? You could do puzzles with me, Juanita! Want to play dress up with me, Juanita? <laughs> Thanks, but I think I'd like to string beads. That's what I want to do, too. Me, too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
need a necklace. Lily, you're supposed to tie a knot in the bottom of the string. Oops, I forgot. Yours is pretty. Thank you. <gasps> You're leaving already? Mama, don't go. I'm not ready for you to go yet. You're welcome to stay as long as you like. And the wizard said, there is one more thing you must do before you can become king. And then? Then he said, you have to climb the highest mountain to prove how brave and strong you are. And then? And then Melvin climbed up the mountain and... Um... Thank you, Charles. And then? And then a big gust of wind blew Melvin right off the mountain. And then? Uh... That's our story, Hat Juanita. It means you get to make up the ending to our story. And then, a bird caught him in the air and flew him back home to his village, and they crowned him king and had a big party with churros for everyone. Very good. Thank you, Juanita. What are churros? They're sweet cinnamon treats. Interesting. Mama, could we make some for school? Yes, that would be fun. Yeah, that would be good. Thank you, Juanita. But right now, it's time for... Recess! <laughs> You're not leaving, are you? No, I'll stay and watch you play, Juanita. Push harder, right? I want to go really high. Harder, Mama. <laughs> I can go higher than you can. Push harder, Mama. <laughs> They're going higher than I. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> hey! <laughs> I'm the best pusher. Not as good as me! <laughs> this is fun, Mama. Since you have such good helpers, Juanita, <laughs> do you think it would be all right if I go now? Mama, please don't go. I'm not ready for you to go yet. If you need me to stay a little longer, I will. Recess is over, boys and girls. <laughs> <laughs> Juanita seems fine now, but she gets upset when I try to leave. I understand. I'm sure she'll let us know when she's ready for you to go. Oh dear, I'm out of apple juice. Hmm, perhaps you can help me with that. Juanita, we're all out of juice for snack time. May I ask your mother to go to the store to buy us some more juice? How long will it take? Not very long. Okay, but will you come right back? I will. Thank you, Juanita. She'll come back. Mothers always come back. But what if I need her? I needed my mama on the first day of school, too. But then I was having so much fun, I didn't need her to come with me anymore. Yoko, Juanita, I hear that Doris's restaurant needs some customers. Would you like to play with them? All right. Okay. May I take your order? Yes, please. I would like an enchilada with Eros Verde. Uh, I don't know if we have that. It's Spanish for an enchilada with spicy rice. How about fried eggs instead? Oops. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder when we're going to eat for real. I'm hungry. Mama's not back yet. Mama, you 
were gone a long time. I missed you. I'm back now. I always come back. Thank you. Thanks, Juanita. I'll take this out for recycling. When can we have cupcakes again, like last week? Remember, Frank, that was a special treat for Fritz's birthday. Maybe it is somebody's birthday today. Is it your birthday, Juanita? No, but it is my mama's birthday. Yeehaw! Oh, yeah! We must do something special then. Like have a surprise party. How can we give her a surprise party if she's right here? Maybe your mama could just close her eyes and cover her ears? <laughs> Why would I want to do that? Mama, you have to go now, or we can't give you a surprise. I see. But you have to promise to come back at the end of the day. I will. I always do. The classroom looks so pretty. I just wish I had a special present to give Mama. I know what you could give her. A day off? You think Mama would like that? Oh, yes. Mama's back already? Here we go, everyone. All set? One, two, three. Happy birthday! <laughs> was a wonderful surprise. And I have a present for you. You do? Yes. Tomorrow, you can have the whole day off to do whatever you want. You don't have to come to school. Really? Yes. I'm going to ride the bus by myself and everything. But you know, I'll always come back if you need me. I know, Mama. You always do. 